Hey makers, it's Mel. Today on Makers Moments, I'm going to teach you how to formulate your soaps for different applications, including hair, beard, face, and more. The world of soap is a vast one. There are so many incredible products that you can make. Here are some of our tips on formulating for a variety of different functions. The first thing to keep in mind when formulating for the face is the face's pH. Facial skin is much more delicate than skin on your body, so you'll want to reach for ingredients that are gentle, moisturizing, and form a moisture barrier on the skin's surface. Reach for oil bases with moisture-retaining humectant and natural antibacterial properties like rosehip oil, olive oil, and coconut oil. You can then combine these with pore-refining materials like clay, charcoal, or sea mud, and skin-nourishing nutraceuticals like vitamin E or vitamin C for added cleansing benefits. If you're looking to make a hair or beard-oriented soap, your ingredients can be a little bit less moisture retentive and a little bit more clarifying. You'll want to formulate your base using surfactants. Surfactants are ingredients that allow you to blend otherwise incompatible compounds to create a cleansing and foaming effect in your product. Opt for using base oils such as argan, jojoba, or coconut, and add harder oils such as shea butter and emulsifying wax for extra moisture conditioning. If you're looking to break into the woman's personal care section and make what many refer to as yoni soap, you'll want the most gentle formulation. Dermatologists and gynecologists recommend using plain, fragrance-free, dye-free cleansers. There is a delicate balance between beneficial and harmful bacteria, and an imbalance can occur if the pH is not acidic enough. So it's important to formulate using simple ingredients such as coconut oil, olive, or hemp seed oil, and avoid adding fragrance and common allergy ingredients such as lavender or botanicals that can cause irritation and allergic reactions. There are so many different formulations that you can create. What are some of your favorite applications? Let us know in the comments below and be sure to subscribe to our channel to stay in the know on all the latest makers tips and tricks. Happy making!